Hey, I'm Andre from Bootstrapius.com. Welcome to my Bootstrap tutorial. Today, you will learn what Bootstrap is and what are its main advantages. This tutorial is a part of my series of videos for Bootstrap beginners. So, let's get started. What is Bootstrap? Bootstrap is a modern front-end framework to speed up and help you with website development. Front-end framework means that it can help you with your website's layout and design, but it cannot do any back-end stuff as sending an email, keeping an eye on your visitor's shopping basket, or accessing a database. We will talk about its advantages a bit later, but one of its most important features is that it adds responsivity to your website, so your website will adapt to the user's device. Bootstrap is also the most popular front-end CSS framework today. According to the data provided by BuiltWith.com, more than 20% of the top 1 million websites use Bootstrap. The framework consists of the set of two files, Bootstrap.js and Bootstrap.css. If you include them on your HTML page or website, it will enable you to use its HTML components and features. Now, it's time to have a look at Bootstrap's main advantages and what useful features it might bring into your life of a developer. The first significant advantage, as I mentioned already before, is its responsive grid. You can quickly lay out your web page using the Bootstrap grid by creating columns and rows. Do you need four items on a row on a desktop, three on a tablet, and only one on mobile? No problem with Bootstrap. The second important advantage is the extensive collection of pre-made HTML components that are shipped with Bootstrap. I will try to outline the most important ones and the ones you'll probably need on almost every website you will build. First are buttons with their color variants, primary, secondary, their outline variants, and much more. Then, there's the Bootstrap navbar. Have you ever wondered how to build an excellent working responsive navigation from scratch, how to display horizontal navigation on larger devices like laptops and computers, and display it as a sliding out navigation that appears after the click on an icon on mobiles? Well, I surely did before I started using Bootstrap. Building custom and flexible navigation elements with Bootstrap is straightforward. You will also need to format your portfolio items or e-commerce products. Bootstrap has a useful UI element for this, Bootstrap card. A handy component is also the drop-down, you can use it in various menus or on your buttons. Then, there's a pagination element, carousel, tooltips, alerts, and forms. I will try to talk about all of them in one of the next episodes, but I think you get the idea from this list that Bootstrap is full of components. Back to Bootstrap's main advantages. As a number three, there's the cross-browser compatibility. An essential fact that we shouldn't forget is that the web browser market is very fragmented, and not all browsers interpret the CSS correctly or the same. Bootstrap supports all the modern web desktop and mobile browsers and also the older ones such as IE11. Number 4, Bootstrap is easy to use. If you are a beginner in the web design and coding world, the good news is that Bootstrap doesn't require any extensive coding skills to get started. You will need just a basic HTML and CSS knowledge, and you're good to go. Advantage number 5, Bootstrap is actively developed. When it comes to software, an important thing to consider is how often the software gets upgraded and bugs fixed. Perfect is that Bootstrap is under active development, and new features, bug fixes, and improvements are released frequently. At the time of the making of this video, we are waiting for Bootstrap 5. Number 6, Flexibility. If you are just getting started with web design, you will probably be happy with the default Bootstrap components. When you get more advanced, you can customize everything in Bootstrap either using plain CSS or SCSS, which is a CSS preprocessor in which the Bootstrap is written. Last but not least, the advantage number 7. Community. A fantastic community of users and websites has formed around Bootstrap since its original creation. Now, you can find great third-party themes, templates, snippets, and also JavaScript plugins built explicitly for Bootstrap. 
The great thing is that all these templates and themes, or at least the good ones, use the same Bootstrap syntax, so if you know Bootstrap, it will be effortless to orientate yourself in a third-party theme or template. Don't forget to check out bootstrapius.com for an excellent selection of themes and templates. This brings us to the end of the first part of my tutorial. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button just below this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the Bootstrapius YouTube channel. Don't miss the second part of this tutorial, where I'll show you how to build your first Bootstrap landing page, step by step. Thank you for watching and see you next time.